What is going on guys, this is Carbon Fighter and we're back today with another Forza Horizon 3 video and this time it's not a car review or anything. It is basically my walkthrough of the Hot Wheels expansion for Forza Horizon 3. So enough talking right now, we're going to go right ahead into the expansion pack and we're going to travel there right now. You have arrived at your destination. You gotta love the Lexus SC300 with the 2JZ in there. Incredible, aren't they? I mean, sure, they look the part. But just wait till we get them out there. Trust me, you're gonna see things from a whole new perspective. Jesus Christ, those cars are unreal. Forza Horizon 3 Hot Wheels. I think every kid should have some experience with Hot Wheels before. I remember when I had some Hot Wheels. I remember I had like a small yellow Ford Mustang. Like the 1970s, I believe. Those kind of versions. Not sure exactly on what the year is, but it was like an old Bumblebee. This place is unreal. The largest, fastest, and most extreme island the world has ever seen. Pitch yourself, boss. It's real. Holy crap. Jeez. Stay in fifth gear. Oh, there was nothing to see there, guys. That was just the PC not rendering it. But this is incredible. Oh, the loop, the loop! I never had one of those. I honestly hope I don't have to shift any more up than six, because my shifter does not have seven or eight. I feel like I kind of have to, but. Then again, I don't know what this car has. Ah, uh, yeah, forgot to mention, we're still putting the finishing touches on the track. Oh. Kinda lost control there, but... Giant mechanical dinosaurs. We spared no expense. Oh, I hope I made that. Is that Lamborghini Centenario? The thing that occurs to me right now is that the car that I'm driving right now, I feel like it's the, like the iconic image of Hot Wheels. I never had this when I was a kid, like that car, but I feel like it was iconic and I always see it everywhere. Like, I don't know why. But this thing, this expansion pack is insane. Almost reminds you of the GTA races now. Like, you know how GTA races are set in the sky these days? People make them up. With the fire rings and everything. Woo! Let's go, guys. Hot Wheels. Beat that.
Here it is, boss. Horizon Hot Wheels. You check the place out. I'm gonna go find the toy box. <laughs> so these cars aren't even real. It just says Hot Wheels <laughs> Rip Rod. I guess that's our car well, now. Fit in your pocket, but it'll go a lot faster. Okay. Yes, it's the only car I can choose. Jason, here's how this is gonna work. The Hot Wheels people will be testing bigger and crazier setups, so I'll hook you up with faster and faster cars. We'll give out medals as qualifiers. Any questions? Nope. Then get out there. All right, so we're gonna go to our first sprint race. The map here is insane. Here we go. We'll start slow. Give you time to adjust to the <clears throat> conditions. Don't worry. Once you see Hot Wheels' idea of slow, you'll understand why we have to build up to fast. Okay. So we're gonna do the Hot Wheels campaign, epic stunt sprint. Uh, we're gonna try out the Hot Wheels rip rod because. This is Hot Wheels, of course, and we're gonna use my other cars later on down the road. So do wheels actually get catch on fire? Oh, oh, I misshifted. Alright guys, so we are in 7th place. Shift to 5th. Imagine how cool it will be to have this rip rod right here in real life. Like how would you register it, the insurance, and... But who cares, right? Like, you have a Hot Wheels car ready at your disposal. Shift down to 4th. So we can make that turn. I see a Supra up there, the blue one. That's cool, that's cool. Oh, I wonder if you can fall off. I'm not gonna do it now, but I wonder if you what happens if you fall off. Shift up to fifth. I'm sorry guys, I'm gonna have to do go travel back in time. I misshifted everything. There we go. That's how it was supposed to be. What? Yeah, something's up with my sixth gear on the shifter. I'm not exactly sure why. I hope I can go back in time for that. Jeez, I'm always bouncing off the rev limiter, that's not good. But yeah, if you have a controllable car in, in this um, expansion pack, it'll be good. Because you don't have to worry about like it sliding everywhere. Shift down. I don't think I'm going to ever win this race. Because I'm still trying to get used to the conditions.
I like the Forza expansion packs every time. Like I did the Fast and Furious expansion for Forza Horizon 2, it was a standalone game, and that thing was amazing, like, you don't even have to buy it, and it's free for everyone, so I really give props to Forza for doing that. What is wrong with my 6? Oh, I'm gonna have to go back time. So apparently I was in fourth gear, which there's just something wrong with my shifter. Second gear. All right, we're gonna shift up. Maybe one more. Another one. Fifth gear. I don't know why, whenever I see those black um, circles on the ground, I always think of them as oil slicks. I don't know why. So I'm gonna have to hold 6 gear in place. Alright, so we're a sixth place, guys. Not the best, but this is basically my first time playing Hot Wheels. So I say that's pretty decent. Well, to I'm not gonna make this video any longer than it should be. I'm gonna end the video here. Be sure to like, subscribe for more, and check out my other Forza Horizon videos on my channel. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next one.